Welcome to Morocco. Morocco, often known as the Kingdom of Morocco, is the westernmost nation in North Africa's Maghreb area. Its land boundaries with Algeria to the east and the disputed territory of Western Sahara to the south overlook the Mediterranean Sea to the north and the Atlantic Ocean to the west. The Spanish colonies of Ceuta, Melilla, and Pion de Vélez de la Gomera, as well as a number of smaller Spanish-controlled islands off its coast, are also claimed by Morocco. With a population of about 37 million, it covers an area of 446,300 square kilometers, 172,300 square miles, or 710,850 square kilometers, 274,460 square miles. Islam is the official religion, while Arabic and Berber are the official languages, the Moroccan Arabic dialect and French are also commonly used. A lively fusion of Berber, Arab, and European civilizations makes up Moroccan identity and culture. Its major city is Casablanca, while Rabat serves as its capital. The first Moroccan kingdom was founded by Idris I in 788, it has been inhabited since the Paleolithic era, around 90,000 years ago. In the following years, it was ruled by a number of distinct dynasties, reaching its pinnacle as a regional power during the Almoravid and Almohad dynasties' dominion over the majority of the Iberian Peninsula and the Maghreb in the 11th and 12th centuries. Morocco experienced external threats to its sovereignty in the 15th and 16th centuries when Portugal annexed some land and the Ottoman Empire expanded eastward. Other than that, the Marinid and Saudi dynasties resisted foreign occupation, and Morocco was the only country in North Africa to avoid Ottoman rule. After seizing control in 1631, the Alawite dynasty, which continues to rule the nation today, cultivated diplomatic and commercial ties with the West during the following two centuries. Due to Morocco's advantageous location near the mouth of the Mediterranean, France and Spain partitioned the country into separate protectorates in 1912, reserving Tangier as an international zone. After sporadic uprisings and riots against colonial rule, Morocco earned its independence and was reunited in 1956. Morocco has remained reasonably stable since since becoming independent. It is regarded as a medium power in international affairs and a member of the African Union, the Union for the Mediterranean, and the Arab League. It has the fifth largest economy in Africa and exerts substantial influence in both Africa and the Arab world. With an elected parliament, Morocco is a unitary semi-constitutional monarchy. The King of Morocco and the Prime Minister are in charge of the executive branch, and the House of Representatives and the House of Councillors are responsible for the legislative branch Western Sahara which does not have its own government, is claimed by Morocco as part of its southern provinces. In 1975, a guerrilla conflict broke out between Morocco and Mauritania and some of the local population after Spain decided to decolonize the region and hand control up to them. The battle went on despite Mauritania giving up its claim to the region in 1979. Morocco Best 10 Attractions 1. Marrakesh Medina Marrakesh Medina with the Atlas Mountains in the distance. The bustling and vibrant buzz of Marrakesh Medina sums up Morocco for many visitors and is a major tourist attraction. The old city is entered from the vast plaza of Gemma LFNA Square where, it seems, half the city converges throughout the day and into the evening to hang out with the stall vendors, traditional musicians, snake charmers, and random acrobats. Once inside the Medina itself, you enter a world of maze-like alleyways and shopkeeper hustle. It's an experience full of colorful and noisy local life and not to be missed on your Moroccan sightseeing trails. 2. Chef Chowan. Sitting snug amid the lush Rif Mountains, Chef Chowan is a labyrinth hill town of blue-on-blue -blue buildings that has an incredibly photogenic glow. There isn't much actual sightseeing to be done, 
and that's one of the town's main attractions. A visit here is simply about wandering the Medina alleys and lapping up all that colorful architecture. It's a peaceful, easy-going town and a great place to recharge for a while if you've been spending a lot of time amid the cities of Fez and Marrakesh beforehand. This is also one of Morocco's main hiking and trekking destinations and a starting point and organization center for Rif Mountains walks. 3. Erg Chebbi's Dunes Camel Trekking in Erg Chebbi To see Morocco's Sahara dune fields, you need to head east of the High Atlas Spine to the far eastern desert region that sits near the border with Algeria. The most popular destination for grand and rippling sand dunes is Erg Chebbi. This is prime territory for dune surfing, four-wheel drive dune bashing, and sunrise and sunset camel trekking, usually combined with an overnight stay in a tented desert camp right amid the dune field. Simply sitting amid the sand dune splendor and experiencing the star-filled Sahara sky at night is worthy enough of the long journey it takes to get here. Many travelers book a desert experience package, which includes return transport, usually from Fez or Marrakesh, and an overnight desert camp stay, but you can also independently travel to Merzuga, the village beside the Erg Chebbi dune field, and organize activities once there. 4. Fez El Bali Along with Marrakesh, Fez is Morocco's other big cultural destination. Compared to its sister imperial city to the south, Fez is much less gentrified. The medina here, called Fez El Bali, is a maze of skinny, back alleyways where it's near impossible to not get lost. Amid the Souks area, you'll find the tanneries, where the huge vats of colored dyes are one of the city's iconic sites. As well as the city's artisan heritage, with Souk streets full to the brim with traditional handicrafts, and the scatter of palaces and monuments hidden amid the twisting streets, the main attraction of Fez El Bali is simply heading out on aimless wanders amid the lanes. 5. 8 Ban Hadu This golden stone adobe Ksar, fortified village, thrusts dramatically out of the earth amid scenery that was all who visit. It's a fairy tale place, and unsurprisingly, the orange-hued turrets and curvy lanes inside have become a favorite film location for Hollywood due to the surreal beauty of the place. You can even sleep within the Ksar if you want the full 8 Ben Hadou experience, though those who like their creature comforts should be aware that there's no electricity within the mud-brick-walled building itself. If you're heading out into Morocco's High Atlas region, it should definitely be on your must-visit list. Try to come in the early morning or later in the afternoon, as the tour bus crowds descend from around 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. 6. Essaouira Morocco's most charming seaside town is laid-back Essaouira, which became one of the country's major hippie hangouts during the 1970s. Today a hint of this bohemian past hangs on, and the town is one of Morocco's artistic centers, with a thriving local art scene. For visitors, Essaouira's seafront medina, encased within fortified walls, is the main attraction. Its twisty lanes are home to tiny art galleries, boutiques, and a bustling contemporary cafe and restaurant scene, as well as traditional souk shopping. For those seeking more active sightseeing, there are also great walks along the beach to outlying villages and surfing along the beach. 7. Volubilis Morocco's number one Roman era ruin, and its most famous historic site, is a feast for history lovers. This rambling site is packed full of tumbled columns and temple remnants, standing as reminders that even the greatest empires eventually crumble. The major highlight here, though, is the clutch of intricate mosaic floors amid the ruins, which have been left in situ where they were unearthed. The hilltop location allows the ruins to lord over the surrounding countryside, adding to the romantic ambience of lost glory. Head up through the ruins to the capital and forum for excellent panoramic views over the site and surrounding countryside. Volubilis can easily be visited as a day trip from either Meknes or Fez. 8. Dades Valley 
Erd Chijiga Dune Field. Covering around 40 kilometers, the Erd Chijiga Dune Field is the largest in Morocco. Due to being farther southeast than the more famous Erd Chebbi, and hence less accessible on a short Morocco trip, this vast sand sea of mammoth Saharan dunes attracts less crowds. The major base for Erd Chijiga excursions is the oasis town of Mamut from where you can head out into the desert on 4 WD tours and multi-day camel treks to overnight amid the dunes. Be aware that Mamut is still around 55 kilometers away from the Erd Chijiga dune field, so to reach it in one day from town, you'll need to take a 4 WD tour. There are plenty of smaller dunes surrounding Mamut itself, which short sunrise or sunset camel treks head to. 10. Bab Al Mansour in Me Morocco Best 10 Luxury Hotels. 1. Lou Palais Roll and Spa. Located in the Pamiri district, just 5 kilometers from Marrakesh, Le Pala Roland Spa offers luxury accommodation with two outdoor swimming pools, hammam, hot tub, and massage treatments. All rooms are air-conditioned and some feature a balcony with views of the pool and garden, a seating area, flat-screen TV, safety deposit box and fireplace. The in-suite bathroom includes a bathrobe, hair dryer, and free toiletries. A continental breakfast is available each morning at Le Palais Roll and Spa. The on-site restaurant serves international specialties and guests can relax in the bar with a drink. Additional features include a Moroccan lounge, organization of tour excursions, library and indoor plunge pool. Marrakesh Manara Airport is ideally located a 30-minute drive away. 2. Vichy Celestin's Spa Hotel Casablanca Situated in Buznica, Vichy Celestin's Spa Hotel Casablanca features a wellness luxury clinic which provides a care program, signed Vichy. The hotel boasts indoor and outdoor swimming pools some of which are heated and a golf course. The accommodation provides evening entertainment and free Wi-Fi. The rooms at Vichy Celestin Spa Hotel Casablanca are equipped with a seating area and a flat-screen TV. Each room comes with a private bathroom with a shower, free toiletries, and a hairdryer. The units have a wardrobe. Various restaurants propose gastronomic and dietary cuisines to be enjoyed by the poolsides or in the golf. The wellness center is equipped with the latest technologies such as balneotherapy, cryotherapy, and endermology. The programs include nutritional and sport activities such as aqua sports. 3. Borg des Cascades in Spa Borg des Cascades in Spa features a restaurant, outdoor swimming pool, a bar and shared lounge in Uzoud. A few steps from Uzoud and 5.1 kilometers from Anzad, the property features a garden and a terrace. 4. Palais Farage Suites in Spa Set in the heart of Fez in a former Arab Moorish palace, Palais Farage Suites in Spa offers a view of the Medina. Each air-conditioned, modern suite is decorated with Moroccan zellige tiles and has free Wi-Fi, minibar with free soft drinks and a flat-screen TV with satellite channels. All have a private bathroom and some have a terrace. It features an outdoor pool, spa, hammam, massage treatments, and beauty salon. The reception is open 24 hours a day. A free yoga session is organized every Saturday afternoon, and guests will be able to attend a free meditation session on Thursdays. Breakfast is available daily at Palais Farage Suites and Spa. For other meals, Moroccan dishes are available in Amandir, one of the hotel's two restaurants. There are also two bars on site. 5. Our Bluey Palais Relais and Chateaux. This luxurious hotel features a terrace with a heated outdoor pool with panoramic views of the Medina and the sea. It is just 400 m from the beach in central Essaouira. The Erblui Palais offers spacious rooms and suites with an elegant décor. They come with flat-screen TVs and marble bathrooms, and some also feature Italian showers or balconies. 
At the Bluey Palette, guests can choose from several dining options. The outdoor restaurant, Courtyard Patio, serves both international and Moroccan cuisine, and the Moroccan restaurant serves gourmet cuisine. Light lunches can also be enjoyed on the panoramic terrace. 6. Sofitel Casablanca Tour Blanche is located a two-minute walk from the Medina. This five-star hotel is a six minutes from Mahasan Tumas and it offers two restaurants. Luxurious and contemporary, the rooms are equipped with a private bathroom. They have a seating area and offer views of the city, the Medina, the Great Mosque or the ocean. Free Wi-Fi, a minibar and flat-screen TV are also provided. This 24-floor tower also features a so spa that is spread across two floors, which has a hot tub, a traditional-style hammam, sauna, and a fitness center so fit. Beauty and massage treatments combining French and Moroccan beauty expertise are also available. 7. Takeda Golf Palace Relais and Chateaux The hotel welcomes you in a luxury and typical setting. It boasts a large swimming pool and offers free shuttle service to the beach. Hotel Takeda Golf Palace offers spacious and luminous suites with wide openings on the golf course and the lake surrounding the palace. Each suite is a luxurious combination of elegance and simplicity. Enjoy a pleasant afternoon on the deck chairs by the swimming pool or on the golf course. For your relaxation and your well-being, the palace boasts a spa with access to Turkish bath, a heated pool and many other facilities. You can even choose a massage or beauty treatments. After a relaxing day in the sun, savor gourmet specialties in the restaurant, by the fireplace or on the terrace. 8. Polenna Masker Located in Marrakesh, Polenna Masker is a 25-minute drive from the old Medina. It features an outdoor swimming pool with sunbeds, a wellness center and limousine service. Free private parking is possible on site. Polenna Masker offers luxurious accommodations. All units are spacious and fitted with modern amenities. Each accommodation includes en suite bathroom with shower and bath. American breakfast is served each morning at the property. 9. La Tour Hassan Palace Located in Rabat city center, this prestigious hotel is built in a typical Moorish Andalusian style. It offers luxury air-conditioned rooms, an outdoor swimming pool and a fully equipped wellness center. Rooms at the La Tour Hassan Palace combine traditional materials with modern comforts. They feature spacious bathrooms with bathtub, hairdryer, and bathrobes. They are also equipped with satellite TV and Wi-Fi access. 10. Robinson Agadir This club hotel is next to the Royal Palace in Agadir. It offers direct beach access, exclusive spa facilities, and traditional Moroccan food. Activities for children and teenagers are available. We are very grateful for your interest in the Kingdom of Morocco, and we trust that our comprehensive report has given you all the details you require to plan your subsequent trip. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel Trivlaro for access to everything exciting in the travel and tourism industry. Many thanks and safe travels.